They tried to tell me that yesterday's TikTok about them testing the site was fake. But here's the thing. Even if it was, the timing was impeccable. Okay, okay, as you all have been hearing all morning, we have the new keys, including the, well, they're not new. The only one that's new is the Inspire key. It's inspiring a lot of eye rolls from a lot of people. And listen, I am the first one to give a hot take, but honestly, I think this new program is great and for the majority of people, a huge upgrade. After hearing how unfavorable we all were, I was really expecting a bigger price increase than basically $50, give or take, for most keys, except for the Inspire key, which is, my guess, the new dream key, slightly less attractive sister, I don't know, which is $200 more, which is the prediction that I made in my what do I think is gonna happen with the new dream key situation. I said $200 and I was right. But it is not completely blackout date free, even though some might say that the dream key never really was with the lawsuit, but that's neither here nor there. For the first time, the highest tiered key has Christmas week into New Year's Day completely blocked out. So if you're wanting to go to celebrate the holidays closer or do New Year's, you're gonna have to pay a ticket for that. But other than that, I feel like it's an, it's an upgrade for the most part. The blackout dates are basically the same, besides this, of course. And um, it's only a $50 increase, which I think is fair, especially because this one was so cheap at $3.99 last year. I mean, it was it was like stupid. And more so, I feel like if you're on the lower tier, you are getting benefits, honey, because we did not get parking before with these two. And now you have a discount on parking. Yes, it's Toy Story parking, but we had absolutely nothing before. So beggars cannot be choosers, people. Let's be grateful. And everybody is getting discounts on Genie Plus, which is smart, which is smart. Should they include Genie Plus probably in the highest paid tier? Yeah, I think so but 20% off makes Genie Plus $16 for people, which means that more Magic Keys are probably gonna be incentivized to use it. I know it's only a $4 difference, but people wanna use their perks, y'all. Plus free photo pass downloads for these two. I'm gonna make a separate TikTok about that. That's pretty legit. I wish that all keys got that, but that is a good incentive to get one of these two. I think Believe Keys used to have 15% off merchandise, and now it's only 10. Correct me if I'm wrong, I don't remember, but basically everybody gets 10 except for Inspire. Inspire gets 20% off merchandise, which is, that adds up if you're a merchandise person. I think the majority of former dream key holders are not thinking of going here. I think they're thinking of going here. It's not that many different blackout dates for a lot less money and basically a lot of the same perks. So tell me, what are your thoughts and feelings? I do have another video coming up going into the terms and conditions of this program and the photo pass. What is that really gonna mean and look like? But for now, I'm just gonna ask you what key do you feel like you're gonna get I know what I'm gonna do.